Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So if you can't tell by the title of this video, we are in China. I'm here with my friend Tiani. <laughs> this is the China vlog part two um, because our first vlog was probably like, what, four days or something like that. We came from Beijing to Shanghai to Hangzhou and we were in Hangzhou for two days yesterday and today. Um, and then we're leaving today to go to Suzhou after we finish our tours for the day today. But first things first, breakfast. So we're gonna head downstairs and have breakfast. It is currently, what's the time? 7.40. 7.40 and we have to meet our group at nine o'clock. So we have about like an hour and 20 minutes to eat, which is pretty good. But yeah, we'll see you guys downstairs. I'll show you breakfast here because the buffet here is so good. It's a bit different to the buffet at our last place. But yeah, stay tuned. We were talking before about how every morning we get like a little bit faster at getting ready and getting like our stuff together. We usually only give ourselves half an hour for breakfast because we take that long yeah. to get ready. We have an hour and 15 <laughs> and we're bringing our things with us. I know. We're bringing it to just have with us while we eat or maybe put it somewhere in the lobby. But this is not normal. We're not usually like this. This is a record at the moment. Let's see yeah. if we can be. Imagine uh, coming around for breakfast like two hours early. <laughs> nah, that's never gonna happen. <laughs> cool. This is the eating area. It's really nice. So before breakfast you have to give your room card so they can check you in for breakfast. So, <laughs> waving at our trip to do a few Morning! So many friends! Oh look how comfy these chairs look. Morning! Good morning, how are you? Good! I know! We're surprised he said they're surprised we got up so early. Oh we're surprised. <laughs> See, we're not the only ones that notice that we're the we get up late. She's eating dragon fruit. I want to get some dragon fruit. Mm. I've been eating like absolute crap the past few days and my stomach is hating me for it. So I'm going to try my best to eat healthy, but I don't think it will last very long. Plates, I need a plate. Morning, Roy. Good morning, how are you? <laughs> Good, how are you? I can't <laughs> Oh yeah, I need to show you the food. That's what I was doing. Everyone's been commenting on my videoing for the vlog. It's so funny, keep saying like, oh, why are you videoing? I'm like, oh, for YouTube. <laughs> so funny. Okay, guys, so this is my breakfast. I have watermelon, peach, I'm not too sure what I did, but noodles, rice, and then pastries. This is insane. Being able to eat this for breakfast? Yes. Yum. I was legit like, I'm not gonna eat that much today. I know. I'm not gonna stuff in my face. Said we were here in Hangzhou yesterday and today. Yesterday we had a free day. We did nothing all day. <laughs> Made an effort and went, got ready and went to the shops. But guys, we watched three movies yesterday. Three. Not one, not two. Three. We watched Mamma Mia kind of twice because it re the TV glitched and it restarted. And the shopping center is right across the road. It's so good. Look at my TikTok. Um, there'll be a TikTok about it. But our shopping center is literally right across the road. So we went to the shops, walked around for about an hour, got some little knickknacks and things for my family, which was good. And then after that, came back, watched two movies, and then we were like, mm, we should probably get some dinner. Um, but we got like, um, I got a mango Yakult drink. Oh my gosh, it was the best thing ever. It was like a big Yakult, but mango flavored, and it had like bits of mango in it, it was so yum. And then I got this like, little like cheesy pizza. Oh my gosh, it was so good. It literally tasted like a barbecue pizza, but it was all cheese. I don't know how. I don't know how they did it. We leave in four days. That's really sad. We were talking about Saturdays because once we leave, we're not going to see these people that we're with ever again. It is so sad. Like We've built such good connections with all of the people in our tour group. 
it was just so sad that, to think that we might not ever see them again after this and like a lot of them are quite old which is like so sad like I want to see them again but like a lot of them live in different areas of Australia not they don't all live in Brisbane and, like it'd be weird like just what going to Sydney just to visit them is that weird <laughs> I'd make an exception for them. Oh my gosh, I don't know if you follow me on Instagram, but I posted this thing on my story. Francesca, she's like one of the older ladies here. She was, she was like, oh, do you want me to take a photo of you by the lake? And I was like, okay, here. And I gave her my phone. I was like, oh, here, just spam it. I was like, just keep pressing <laughs> the photo button. She was like, okay. And I was posing. I kept saying, are you hitting it? Are you spamming it? She's like, yep, 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 I am, I am. I got it back and she filmed me posing. It was so funny. She messaged me yesterday and she was like, Oh, I don't know how to charge my portable charger. Can you please come to my room and help me? <laughs> so cute. Feeling really chatty this morning. I'm going to eat because I literally have eaten one thing out of my whole two plates. Another and she's finished. <laughs> oh, she's literally finished. Oh, her food. Okay. But I'll catch up with you guys when we get on the bus. Am I recording? Oh, yeah. Okay, we just got off the bus just there and we just got to the Chinese tea plantation guys look at the freaking view are you kidding me look how pretty it is but basically today we're gonna learn about how they make Chinese tea how they make Chinese green tea from literally from these leaves oh very zoomed in on my face talking to us a little bit right now about how they make Chinese green tea from these leaves um, but I can't really hear her. <laughs> She's all the way up there. But oh, guys, this video is insane. Oh my gosh, look how pretty it is. Okay, so in like a little classroom kind of thing. I think we're gonna learn how we can have to make green tea, just things that are on the table. my stomach I feel like. I feel nice. Yeah I'm feeling quite what? nice. So we did some purchasing. Yeah they got us again and we purchased more things. We got a bit of tea which was good though because I want to gift it to my family at home like my mum and that. But now we've come to to West Lake which is in Hangzhou and so we're gonna go to the lake and then we're going to get on a boat I'm pretty sure. So that's really exciting. It is so pretty here. Like the scenery here is just gorgeous. I can't wait to see what the lake look like, looks like as well. It's gonna be so pretty. Okay, I'll catch you guys soon. Hey guys, we just got to the lake and look how beautiful it is. Are you kidding me? This is like out of a movie. Look how pretty, oh my gosh. Guys, it is gorgeous here. Look at the view and there's like a star oh, there are so many stores here as well like there's like a starbucks but it's like in the bush okay so tiani just told me 
that right under the water here there's a stage because we saw a photo of um, ballerinas dancing on the water and I was like what the heck but there's actually a stage right under the water and that's how people perform on the water that's crazy and she said that she had that little poem said to her up on that bridge she had a what and that little poem <laughs> maybe it was that bridge one of the bridges this is actually really romantic apparently this is the most romantic place in Hangzhou so if you have a boyfriend or a girlfriend, bring them to China, bring them to Hangzhou, and come to Westlake, because it is just beautiful. And these are the boats that we're going to go on. This is crazy. I wish I was here, Vinny. Okay, so we're lining up in this line to go down here to get on one of the boats to do a boat ride. came to this little pop-up convenience store. Oh, can't even show you. This little store and it's right next to the bus stop which is cute. But we got these pineapple ice blocks. They're so yummy and it was only 6 won, which we converted. It's $1.30 Australian which is so good. Mm, our friends have bought some now too. It's literally so yummy. But you should try this. Oh, so yum. Pineapple, it's so yum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the lollies over here, they come like in a container thing, yeah. don't they? Or they've all come in, whereas we just have them in bags. Mm. The plastic thing? You come in a oh. plastic container thing. The ice blocks, yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry, yeah, we call them, in England, we call an ice block a lolly. Mm. Yeah. Ice block, it's lolly. Lolly. So what do you call lollies? Sweets. Sweets. No. But the ring, the You're a bit confusing. Thing, the thing on a stick is a lolly. Oh, lollipop or just lolly? Just lolly, little lollies. Yeah, like, little and I, lollies. yeah, a nice lolly, a lolly. lolly. It's like out here, chips are just chips, like no matter what it is. Hot yeah, chips. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we like, you know, like Lay's chips. We call them fruits. Mm. Yeah. Are you still recording? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's Anna. Here he is. Uh -huh. Our bus is here. Yay! Aircon. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to crank the aircon on me. Oh, it's so hot. Okay, we're back on our bus. Driving one hour to go get some lunch. Okay. <laughs> I slept for maybe an hour, maybe an 40, half an hour to 45 minutes. And now we're here at some sort of, I don't know if this is like an eatery place or. Yeah, it's like a servo, but there's heaps of food. So I think it must be like a stopover. Bit they've kind of built up. Yeah, so we're here now and there's apparently heaps of food options that we can get. This is Joseph and Francesca. We haven't eaten since 
after, uh, since breakfast this morning actually. So let's see what they have. There are actually quite a few options in here. It's like a massive food court. It's actually quite nice. Okay, I just got my food. This is what I got. She filled it to the max, which we love. Um, and this is Tiani's food. So yum, but she doesn't know how to use chopsticks, so and they only had chopsticks, so she's gonna ask if um, Starbucks have any um, forks. Um, but I think I also might go and get a rice dish because I, I feel like rice, like just a little thing of rice to have on the side, because that's what I feel like. Oh, I'm struggling to use these too. Mmm. And I also got this like flatbed, flatbread like roti thing. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. So good. Oh my god, this is so good. So we're gonna eat and then get back on the bus and then it's gonna be about an hour and a half drive to get to Suzhou, which is where we're going from Hangzhou. I probably sleep on the bus. I want to try and edit, but I've been getting motion sick, so every time I go to edit on the bus, I get a really bad headache and I feel kind of like sick in my stomach, like I need a vomit, which sucks because like, I'm wasting all of that time. Like it's like two hours I could edit like three videos and that. But yeah, I'm gonna eat and then I'll catch you guys on the bus. I just calculated how much it was for this and this, guys. It was five dollars and eighty cents Australian, like after converted to Australian dollars for this meal. And I'm so full. That's crazy. And for her dish, she only paid three dollars. Mm -hmm. Like, what the heck? We're getting a full filling lunch. So I probably have to take with me onto the bus, which is good though. For five bucks. That's freaking crazy. This would be like. 12, 20 dollars. 20 bucks with both of it. Mm. Made 15 for just the mm -hmm. food. That's crazy. Okay, we just got off the bus. Got my bags and my suitcase. But guys, look at where we're staying tonight. Look how beautiful this place is. Are you kidding? There's a full on fountain in the front. And look how beautiful this place is. I'm going to stand here and take a photo of this for my Instagram because like what? This is insane. Look at that photo. Focus, focus, focus. Look at that photo. <gasps> and I'm also going to take a photo of this. This is just crazy. Anyways, we're going to go get our room keys and check into our room and I'll give you a little room tour. That's where I was standing, just over there. So I'm going to film whole experience for you guys because why not? Oh my hand is so shaky. Okay guys, we got busy talking in the lobby with one of the other ladies from the other group. She was so lovely, basically sold us a trip to South Africa, so keep an eye out for that vlog. But first, a room tour, like I said I would give you. And we're actually on the ground level, which feels super weird. Like, knowing you're on the ground level just feels weird for no reason. Anyways, as soon as you walk in, you have the bathroom on your right. Very nice. I love these mirrors. They have these mirrors in like every um chinese hotel that we've been in so nice this is the main mirror sink guys look at this soap it's literally like crystal clear like it's oh no 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 it is so pretty i want to take it home but i've opened it already so i'm going to see if if anyone else around hasn't opened theirs, I might ask if I can have their soap because my dad would like that. A little countertop here, which is cute. Toilet, shower, very nice. We've got the two heads, one at the top and then the one that you can take around with you. Um, then we have a cupboard here to the left of the door. Ooh, we have robes. Oh, right, let's actually wear the robes tonight. Yeah, we have to, we might use them. So we have robes, we have an ironing board and an iron. Hello. Um, oh, we've got some other things in here. What's this? A fire escape mask. 
cool. <laughs> oh, we've got these like tote bag things. Okay, I think I'm gonna take one. Yeah. Um, okay. I know, I was looking at this. Um, then we have a cute little countertop here with a kettle. I don't know what's in here. Nothing. But I think this is for tea, which would be really cute to have. And then a cute little mirror. Then we have this random clothing rack. We have a suitcase holder. And here are our two beds. This is actually a really nice little room. <laughs> And Tiani's trying to control the TV because we're watching a Chinese TV show at the moment. Um, and look, we've also got like a lazy boy couch, which is actually so cute. Little coffee table, my suitcase, and then a desk with a lamp. This room is very cute. I want to have a look at our view, actually. It's quite scary, actually. Okay, show it. Oh my gosh, dude. What? It's like a, um, like a resort. What? Yeah, look, there's another fountain yeah. over there. Yeah, you know everyone went out the back? Yeah. I want to go out the back and have a look. Yeah, yeah, look, and there's a... Okay, let's go Okay, I'm quickly putting on a jumper and then we're going to go for a walk. Um, because we want to, I don't know, just see what's outside. Also got given these slippers. They're really cute. She bought the tickets. Yeah, she just said dumb. Oh my gosh, stop. Oh my gosh, guys, also something to look forward to. In two days, we're going to Disneyland, right? Tiani and I were going to go by ourselves, but we've convinced two other couples to come with us. So there's six of us going to Disneyland. It's like there's, there's two other young couples in the group. And yeah. So coming, and, it's just so and they're like, wait, you're going to Disneyland? We're like, yeah. And then they're like, okay, can we come? We're like, yeah, of course. So we all got fast passes, the same like lot of fast passes, because there are different kinds of fast passes that you can get. So yeah, we're all gonna go together and it's so exciting. I cannot wait, but yeah, I'm, that's gonna be its own separate vlog. So yeah, I can't wait for that. But yeah, we're gonna go for a little walk and then come back, try and connect to the Wi-Fi. Guest, guest. Guest, guest. But yeah, um, I'll probably bring you guys along on the walk just cause. Okay guys, I literally put the spare battery in and then left you guys in the room. So I had to come back and get you. I'm wearing my slippers <laughs> out for a little walk tonight. I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't even feel like I'm wearing shoes. It feels like I'm walking barefoot. So I feel like my feet are gonna really hurt after this walk, but that's okay. We're just gonna walk around and see what's around. Because when we were talking in the lobby, I was seeing heaps of people from our group just walking outside. And I was like, what? So I'm excited to see what's out there. Oh, there are like some sort of lights outside. Oh, are you kidding me? This is so nice. Oh, there's a map, but our room is like there. <laughs> okay, so we're there. Oh my gosh, it's a massive place. <gasps> There's a tennis court. There's a massive gymnasium. Look at that gymnasium. Oh, gym. Oh, family villas. <gasps> are you so kidding? Cool. So all those things with the lights on are villas, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go for a little walk. Have a little wander around our home for one night because tomorrow we're heading to Shanghai. Oh, this is so cute. And these are the family villas. Oh my gosh, I'd love to stay... <gasps> Oh my gosh, imagine like big like family holiday, like your extended yeah. family and everything in one of these villas. Like it's giving a... Um, grown-ups? Yeah, it's giving grown-ups. Dude, I want a life like that. Yeah, that's what it's giving. My whole goal in life is to grow up with like family friends and we all just go on holidays and everyone's just best friends. Right, and all your kids are best friends. Yeah. That would literally just be the best. You guys, look at these. These are the family villas. This is a bit of a better look. That is so cute. It's like, oh, the door's open. But guys, look how nice. Like imagine a family holiday here. Wait, they're all open. Oh, maybe they're gonna wait, I'll have a look. Okay, I had a little peek in that one because the door was wide open and there was no one in there. But it's kind of like office space. It's not really like, oh my God, that rocking chair. Oh. It's not really like housing. I don't really know. Yeah. Oh my gosh, these lights light up when we're walking by. And look, that's the main hotel over there. That's the main hotel over there, which is where we're staying. Oh, shut up. It's a little lake. Hey guys, so we just got ready for bed. I actually forgot to vlog. We went across the road to look at this convenience store, but it was kind of sketch and people were just like smoking right in our faces. I didn't even realize though. So we came back to the hotel and now we're eating chocolate, Australian chocolate. And I have this cake with me from like our plane two days ago. I don't even know if it's still good to eat. I ate my last night and it was good. Okay, well, I'm gonna eat mine and probably, I don't know, edit some videos or maybe just sleep. But yeah. Put some stories up. Yeah, put some Instagram stories up, but we've got like a big day tomorrow. So we're gonna get some rest. Thanks guys for coming along today, but I'll bring you guys along with me tomorrow and then 
do a separate vlog the next day for Disneyland. Love you guys. See you tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It is officially day one of Sujo. Um, I bought these clips. Don't know if I suit it. <laughs> this camera is making me feel like I should take them out, but I feel like it looks better in real life. Anyways, just ignore it for now. <laughs> well, no way for breakfast. Oh, no, wait to breakfast. Um, this hotel is so nice. And I really hope breakfast is nice too. Because I'm really excited. Oh, it smells good. Okay, breakfast is down this whole morning. Oh. Oh, this is humongous. You guys, stop it right now. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. The bread section, salad section. Cereal section. I feel like cereal this morning. This is pumpkin, bacon. Mm. These look good. Okay. And fruit. Okay, I forgot to show you guys what I ate, but we just finished breakfast and I'm so full. Cool. I'll put photos here. Um, but now we are heading back to the lobby because we have to go check out our rooms and then get on the bus. Breakfast hall is insane. Oh, our group is leaving. Okay, see you guys on the bus. Okay, so we're here at Suzhou's famous lingering garden. Apparently there are four famous gardens here in Suzhou and this is one of them. This is so pretty. We're here at the lingering garden. It's so beautiful. This is just crazy. It's insane. Ready? I didn't look at this little bow. That's so cute. But look how pretty this is. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. I can't tell if you can see, but the air is kind of like smoky, but it just smells so like fresh. I don't know how to describe it. I don't think it's like smoky, I think it's like mist. It smells so fresh. Like almost like fruity, but I don't know how to describe it, but it just smells so nice. Yeah. We're probably gonna go get some photos over there where everyone is. But it's such a pretty view. I just took some photos and they look so good. Um, but look how pretty this is. Oh, what is he doing? I think he's cleaning the lake. Stop. I need a video for my Insta. By my Insta. Okay. This so pretty. How do people get down on that rock? Oh, no, it's over here. Oh my gosh, look at the view. Are you kidding? Okay, this is the little rock ledge thing I was talking about. I'm scared I'm gonna drop my camera in the water. <gasps> oh, look at this. That's kind of scary. Look at how pretty it is. I'm gonna take some photos. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. Oh my goodness. Up there. So we've lost our group. Um, um, but the other group tour guide, she said for us to follow her and she'll lead us back to our group. <laughs> so, where's Tiani? Oh, she's back there. So we're going to follow um, the other group. But it's weird because we don't really know anyone in that group, but that's okay. This is called a booby trap and you're supposed to step on the money first, then the flower, then the money, then the flower, then the money, then the flower. Not the flower, then the money because otherwise that's bad luck and you'll be trapped at our group. We found them. That was stressful. That was very stressful. Oh, okay, we made it. These are bonsai trees. One of the oldest bonsai trees in the world, apparently. I think is that what she said is here. Oh no, one of the biggest. I'm not sure which one it is though. Oh, okay, all right. This is the big mama bonsai. Whoa. 220 years old, this tree. Look how big it is. Take a photo. Take a photo. I can't take a photo. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> Guys, this is the largest bonsai. I don't know if it's the largest in the world, but it's the largest here in the Lingering Garden and is 220 years old. We're leaving the Lingering Garden, I'm pretty sure. We just took a few photos and now we're leaving. Jojo, I like your jokes yesterday. Okay, so we're left 
the lingering garden, we're getting back on the bus and um, we're going somewhere else. Okay, so apparently we're going to a brick museum um, now. That should be interesting. I really need some water. <laughs> okay, so we've just gotten off the bus, that's our bus over there. We're gonna walk around and look at some stores. After this we're going to a museum and then after that we're driving to Shanghai, which is very exciting. We just don't know what time the hotel rooms will be ready. I'm not actually stressed. I kind of, I don't really mind going with the flow because life's easier when you're not stressed, you know what I mean? So go to like a lookout um, of this area called the Bund in Shanghai. Um, and I cannot wait for you guys to come along with us, guys. I'm so excited to show you guys. Um, the clips are growing on me. They're growing on me. We literally just grabbed a jumper and ran because I don't know what the weather's going to be like tonight. Hopefully it's not too cold because I don't really want to wear a jumper tonight. Let's quickly get this camera bag because it's got spare batteries in here for my camera. It is very hot. Okay, so we got dropped off into the in the city. So we're actually in the city. We're so excited. We want to try and go to the Bund tonight, but we we'll have to. We want to eat first and see if we have enough time because it's like a half an hour drive. We have to catch um, like an Uber. But look how pretty it is here. Hey guys, we're at McDonald's. I just got my meal. Six o'clock. Yeah. I'm so excited to eat you guys. I'm starving. And I, all I felt like was a burger. I also got um, a dessert and an iced chocolate. So I got mm, this dessert. I got a double Angus Max burger. Oh, look at this. Yeah. This is the burger in here. We'll see where we go after this. Mm. This is so good. Okay. Talk to you soon. Okay, so we just finished our food and we're in a taxi. We're having some difficulties because we can't speak Chinese. <laughs> um, so we had to show them on our phone where we're trying to go. Is the car even on? Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> can't even feel the engine. But yeah, so we're going to the Bund. A bit hot. Can you crack your window, please? <laughs> Let's see if we make it there and back in one piece. <laughs> if we make the bus there on the way back. <laughs> Let's see if we make the bus. And I took photos of where we are. <clears throat> and we should screenshot. But we just need to go back to the Mercedes Benz. Yeah. What's it called again? Mercedes Benz Arena. Oh, okay. She went, huh? I was printing a receipt. <laughs> Can't hear the engine. I know this car is so smooth. Are we not moving? Okay, we'll see you guys when we get there. <laughs> okay, we just got out of the taxi, guys, and we made it to the point. It is so beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys when we get up there. So we're going up to this viewing area right here, and then we're gonna get a better view of the city. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. You're gonna get my reaction. <gasps> Oh my god! 
Oh my gosh, this is unreal. This is literally unreal. Oh my gosh, my camera cannot even do justice. But guys, dude, I'm so glad we came. <laughs> This is so crazy! So this is the bond. Oh my gosh, this is crazy! And we've come with our friends here from the tour. Okay guys, look how beautiful this building is. I literally feel like I'm in Europe. Look at that down there. Are you kidding me? We're going for a walk. Oh, I need ketchup. Can you catch up? We're going for a walk. We just went to the Bund and I showed you guys the Bund and it was amazing. But these buildings are still just as beautiful. Like, I just cannot believe I'm here. I just cannot believe this is China. I just don't feel like I'm in China. But then I'm like, what does that even feel like? Like, this is just crazy because we don't see anything about it and what do you know like, yeah you expect just the busy streets and the dirty <laughs> dirtiness and i'm so glad that literally like i'm so glad that i vlogged this whole trip because like this is a side to china that i never even knew existed i would i before we were even coming on this trip i looked on tiktok of like a bunch of stuff about china nothing there was nothing about it and i was like what like i don't even know what it's like but guys this is just insane it is so pretty So we're in the taxi and he's asking us where we're from. We've been talking through Google Translate this whole time. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this our taxi literally loves to drive so fast. It's so funny. We have to be, meet back at the Mercedes Benz Arena, five minutes away. So. Then we're going to meet up with our tour group and get back on the bus and go back home. Okay, that's our Fast and Furious driver, but he's leaving. It was 63-1. We're at the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. Guys, I'll show you. The stadium is huge. It's in the shape of a UFO. Look at it. Are you kidding? This is just so cool. No, it was so funny though because we got into the taxi and we showed him where our address and where we wanted to go. <laughs> We gave him our address and literally showed him where we wanted to go and he was confused but he started driving us anyways. Then we got up like maybe 30 meters and then he stopped and said get out because <laughs> he didn't know where to go. Oh my gosh, it was so funny. So we had to get out and find another taxi. So, But yeah, that was such a good night. Definitely a core cool memory. We're going to try and find the rest of our group, maybe go to the bathroom and then get back on the bus. So this is initially where we were dropped off and look, there's a bus car. I haven't actually seen a busker yet in China. This is so cool. We're gonna quickly go to the bathroom and then come back. Such a good night, I'm so glad we went out. Okay, just got off the bus. Had a nice hour long talk with some friends. And we're back at the hotel. We're probably gonna shower and literally go straight to bed. I'm so tired. I go up to the room, we're gonna shower, get ready for bed, and then I'm gonna close out the vlog because tomorrow is a separate vlog because we're going to somewhere very special and I'm very excited to take you. But yeah, I'll see you soon. Good morning, guys. Today I'm filming a separate vlog, so it's not gonna be a part of this vlog, but I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow because tomorrow is our last day in Shanghai, and then we're gonna be flying back to Australia. So. I'll probably continue this vlog then and then and yeah so but if you want to watch the vlog from today you're gonna to have to go to a separate video love you guys and see you tomorrow leaving our hotel this is our official last time seeing our hotel this is the fit I love my hat goodbye bathroom we are officially leaving China like the memories we've made on this trip the friends we've made. I just cannot believe that it's all over. So sad. One of the older ladies, Francesca, you guys know, the vlog knows. She was like to us this morning, can I get a photo with you girls this morning? Cause I'm not gonna see you after this. We're like, yes. So sad. But it's not completely over yet. We do have our things packed and everything, but we're heading to a bullet train today, which is really cool. And then we're going to do some shopping. That's it. 
Oh, you did thank you. Yeah. Disneyland yesterday. Oh, how did it go? <laughs> it was so it go? good. Oh, right? I had to get it. Oh, it was it's so, so funny. soft. Feel it. Yeah. Oh, gorgeous. Right? I love it. I love it. And did you go and ride? Yeah. In Disneyland? Yeah. Food or? We had um, Avenger Burgers. Yeah. Avenger oh, Burgers? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it God. was so good. I wish we got like a little treat or something, like a Mickey Mouse shape, but we didn't have enough time. We got Mickey Mouse ice cream though, oh, which is cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. lovely, 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 lovely. You'll have great photos. Yes. <laughs> Bye, you two. Stop, they're so cute. So far, I've gotten a gift for everybody except for my dad. So, I need to get my dad something. Also, we were so annoyed. Morning! <laughs> How are you? It was so good. So good. Yeah, had to get the hat to remember it. <laughs> are you guys going today? Yeah, we're going to talk. Oh, okay, we'll see you there. Um, morning. Oh no, everyone's gonna judge me for my hat. That's okay. <laughs> Wait, can you see them waving on? <laughs> Harry and Roy, the vlog knows. Okay, I think we're the last ones down, so I need, really need to get a move on. Oh yeah, so we, we wanted, our goal was to get Disneyland t-shirts. You know, like pajama shirts. But they didn't have anything, they only had jumpers. Morning! They only had jumpers and we, we wanted like a pajama shirt. So hopefully at the place that we're going to today, they're selling Disneyland shirts because I really want one. It's not a bullet train. No, it's a magnetic train. Magnetic train. What's it called again? Oh, the Marla train. <gasps> That's such That's a good moon. Oh! Yeah, the MGB shots. Yeah, I loved it. Very good. Yeah, it was lovely. Do you have a photo of the boat that you're on? No, it wasn't that impressive. The, boat oh. <laughs> the boats following us were look like spaceships, they were cool. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, nice. Nice. yeah, nice. I love it. Feel it, it's really soft. Oh, yeah. Well, that'd be nice to sleep on the plane. I know. It's, like the time. <laughs> it's just so cute. We're at the Mama. Um, magnetic train. Apparently this is the fastest bullet train in the world. Um, goes up to 600 kilometers per hour, but for safety reasons it only goes up to 300 when there are passengers on it. But yeah, we're going to go on a round trip to... Where are we actually traveling to? We're doing a round trip somewhere. It's going to be 14 minutes in total. Seven minutes there, seven minutes back. And then I think we're going to the other side of the lake yeah. in the city. And then, and then we're going to shop it. So there are actually, fun fact, no wheels on this train. So if you can see, there's not even like a train track here because everything's magnetic. Apparently, just before the train goes, it lifts because it's like hovering over the ground and shoots us into the universe. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, so the train just got here. I'm gonna pay the compliment. I want to take a photograph of that one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, I want to wear it. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, it's going to look so cute. I'll oh, hold your hat. No, it's the wrong way. <laughs> no wonder it's yeah, so this bad. way. Oh, it looks so cute. Okay, you can take it. <laughs> 40. 40 dollars, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it looks so cute. Look at yourself. Do you like Gosh. it? Yeah. I wish I got you one now. <laughs> These are different to the bullet trains in Japan. The, the ones in Japan are a little bit taller, I think. These are quite fun. Oh, so when the train goes. You can actually see the speed of the train up here. There. So when we start moving, I'll film it so you can see how fast the train goes. Should I take a photo of you both as well? Oh yeah, you could do, yeah. Your last day of being a photographer. Oh, I know. Ready? Smile. Cheese! Do you want to do a video of where you are? Hi, family. Here we are. 
on the magnetic train, the fastest train in the world. It's going to do 36 kilometres in seven minutes, and we are ready to go. See you soon. Go on. What? The trip to nowhere. The trip to nowhere. We're doing it there and back, over and out. That was perfect. <laughs> Love it. Okay, we're moving, and the speed is climbing. I'll come back to you when we get to 300. Guys, yeah, so we're really climbing now. Oh, it's at 300. <laughs> Speed might push you over. Oh, we made it to 300. It's going quite fast. When we first started, the train was kind of leaning like this, which is scary. It seems calm now. In the carriage behind us, there's like a full photo shoot happening. that was happening on the bus we were told that um, for a moment only for a moment we're gonna pass the other train the other bullet train and I completely forgot that it was happening and it just went past us in like literally in the blink of an eye it just went it, yeah it went so quick that's so scary because obviously it's going at 300 kilometers per hour as well ready watch guys how crazy is that so we've just gotten to the airport and it took us seven minutes to get here and I think after this we're gonna go back to where we started. Go to the city and then go shopping. We've come to the city and we're at the very bottom of this massive tower. And look at this tower too. I need pancakes. And it's got like egg around the outside and it's got chicken inside with potato and lettuce and stuff like that. I think they're having a fight behind me. They're literally fighting. We have seen three fights since being here. I haven't even seen that much in one week in Australia. And we're broken. If you guys have seen my Disney vlog, you can see that people are fighting at Disney as well. Random. Mm. Okay, it's time to regroup. I was wondering where you guys were. Just leaving. We just got to the shopping district. Goals to get a, a, no, a Disneyland shirt, something for my dad, a phone lanyard, and what else? A phone case. I want something. I literally okay, got your We are sweating. I didn't even get to film much because we only had two hours and we were running around trying to find stuff. Okay, well now we're heading to the airport, so to see you guys at the airport. Everyone's so happy because it's our shopping day. Guys, the time has come. We're leaving China. It's kind of like all of a sudden, boom, leaving. Yeah. So all of a sudden, we're leaving. We were just at an activity with our favorite people. Uh, our tour guide, yeah. guide was doing a friends. tour guide was doing a speech and was saying like uh, the Jojo bus is gonna come in another five six minutes. We wait here for the bus. She's saying goodbye. Uh, no no no, we get off the bus. In reality, we're probably never gonna see each other ever again in our lives. We're like, don't say that. But they even know friends. But it's true. Where are we ever gonna go see you? I'm gonna wait. Never. Oh, maybe. Mm. I'll go see. If we're ever in Sydney, I will message her. Yeah, I will too. This is so sad. I don't wanna leave Joe. There's <laughs> Joe. He's right there. I'm gonna miss that man. That was like the longest 10 days of my life. I was scared if we left that it was going to go really fast. So it feels like we left a long time. Yeah. Which is good. Yeah. Good <laughs> they are. <laughs> Guys, we're checking in. We're going home. We go on. We're saying goodbye to everyone soon. Yeah. Well, can we, we get a group photo longest. with Ivy before we go? Yes. <laughs> Calm down, Roy. <laughs> I had to change suitcase. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> Didn't expect you to do it here. Where's Fran? She's coming. They'll be here in a minute. 
Be, she's got my passport. <laughs> <laughs> I should check if I have my passport. Francesca's here. So we've checked into the airport. 7 o'clock China time, 9 o'clock Brisbane time. We're going to get changed into our pyjamas because we want to be comfy on the flight. I tried playing Sudoku. It's so hard. Why is it so hard? It kind of started hurting my brain. Okay. I had to take the long pants off. I knew it. <laughs> I thought, my gosh, you did shit. I stood up and took, because I have these shorts on. Yeah. And I stood up and I'm talking, telling the camera, pulled my long pants down because I have shorts under. Joe got a fright. He thought that I'd, I was just getting what naked. Oh, gosh. But I'm going to do a little mukbang. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, it smells so good. And then I got a hot chocolate. Also, they put whipped cream on top of my hot chocolate. I don't know if that's normal. Let's have a taste test. I asked them not to make it too hot because I'm very sensitive. Are you one of them? Oh, that's so good. Have you not tried it yet? Mm -mm. This is so good. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's good. actually in Brisbane already. We're on the plane from China and um, that whole ride was just like so awkward for me to film because I was with like, anyways it was just really awkward for me to film so I didn't film it and then as soon as we got off it was like go 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 and then we got to the Sydney International Airport transferred to the domestic and our flight was supposed to be at 5 p.m. tonight but we went up to the desk and we were like is there any chance we can get us on an earlier flight like we had to wait five hours and they're like, oh yeah, we can get you on, a, on one and a half an hour. We're like, yes, please. Left Sydney at 1.30, arrived in Brisbane at 1.30. Now we're going to get our bags and see our family. Okay, we found Carrie and Roy, and they've already got their bags. <laughs> That's not yours. Oh my goodness, it's a bag. <laughs> wow. That is so funny. <laughs> Guys, we're saying bye to Carrie and Roy. We've been a fantastic holiday. <laughs> yes. Yes. Thank you so much to you. You've been. You've no, been that's been okay. We've we'll got shit. My car's been enough power here as well. Yeah, yeah, Aww. Yes, bye, bye, guys. Bye. Enjoy your life. Yeah. <laughs> we will. Okay, so Tiani couldn't put everything into her suitcase, so she, we had to put some stuff into mine. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't want my stuff. It's been fun. She's just getting me from the pickup area. Yeah, I know. Okay, we're going to get picked up by our mummies. We're gonna close out the vlog right here, but thank you guys for coming with us to China and back. We made it. So it's so good. I hope you guys liked the two part vlog series. We made friends, we made family. And we've come home safe, which is the main thing. But thank you guys so much for coming along. And we'll see you in the next video. Like, share, subscribe. We look like a mess. But guys, thank you so much for coming with us. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye!